I was born in 1960 in Chile, which is where I'm from. Um, you know, I think things politically in the 60s were, were quite stable because I'm from South America. I grew up playing soccer and uh, football, we called it. Um, and uh, I have to say, I spent most of my childhood years pretending that I was going to be a soccer player, not a, not a musician. Well, I have two amazing kids, you know, and I think that seeing them both being born is kind of an amazing thing that you, it's, a, it's an experience that you kind of feel like you never completely grasp the, the importance of it and the, the joyfulness of it. You know, luckily they're both wonderful and healthy and all of that. And so it was a, an amazing, an amazing thing. I think I would probably have to choose a composer. And I think it, that's a tough one to, to do, but I think I would have to say Bach. You know, I have a particular devotion to Brahms also, and his first violin sonata transcribed for viola is kind of an amazing musical journey. Try to do good, try to help others. I think patience and perseverance my wife won't agree with that at all. <laughs> There's certain activities, you know, that, that have to do with administration that are, I would say, not necessarily my favorite. That's a good, that's a good question, I don't know. I think, I mean, I, I have to say again, you know, it's not a great answer, but perseverance, just dogged perseverance. I think, you know, as some people have more eloquently said it, you know, sort of being the last one on the treadmill. Probably my schedule. I do. I do. I have a... I, I was just talking to the chairman of the board of the New World Symphony about driving fast. He has a beautiful car and we were talking about cars and uh, I have sort of a fun Mercedes-Benz AMG that I take out on weekends and have a good time with it. Well, to be a soccer player. Yeah, I, re I, really, I really thought that was going to be what I was going to do. Well, you know, I'm alone in my car twice a day, every day, going to work and coming back. Uh, going to work, what I have to accomplish. Are there any fires that need to be put out? And uh, just to make sure that I'm organized to get everything done. And on the way home, uh, I'm glad this day passed. And, uh, you know, I hope uh, everything that needed to get done got done. Perseverance. Well, in our field, I think it's, you know, very consistent work over a long time. I think if you want uh, instant gratification, you certainly pick the wrong thing. I can find a lot wrong with every recording that I've made. I think the one that I feel like we, we did, we, we got closer to, to, to that level of satisfaction is probably the transcription of the first Brahms violin sonata. It's a recording that I did with Jeremy Denk. That's a big question. Well, let me start by saying, if I didn't believe in the future of classical music, then what am I doing running a music school? Which basically is all about what we know as classical music. Um, I happen to think that the future for this art form is alive and well and thriving.